Hello, ladies and gentlemen. It's Mike here at Game from Scratch. And uh, if you're an Unreal Engine user, today is going to be a great day. We've got multiple announcements today. And we're going to start off with the easy one. By the way, if it sounds a little weird today, uh, I have a very strange setup. I'm actually recording outside today. So hopefully it doesn't sound too bad. Let me know what you think. Comments down below. Uh, we're going to be doing some interesting stuff over the next couple of weeks, I think. Anyways, let's just jump in. As you know, every uh, month, basically, for the last almost two years now, Microsoft, uh, Epic Games have given away free content for Unreal Engine. And May 2020, no exception. So it is uh, Unreal Christmas for the month of May. So we get a bunch of free assets. And the interesting thing is normally they give away free assets free for a month. And if you buy it during that month, it's yours to keep forever. Once that month is over, uh, that asset goes back to its regular price. However, they normally also give away a couple of assets for free forever. There was nothing added to the free forever collection this month. It was all just uh, new content here uh, for temporary for the month of May. So if you want to grab any of these things, do be sure to pick them up before the month of May is over. But I got to tell you right up front, probably one of the best months I've seen in a long time. And the last few have been getting a little, eh. So this one is definitely an improvement. So first off, we have the Drivable Cars Basic Pack. Uh, this is a collection of 3D assets and blueprints, GTA-style drivable cars for Unreal Engine 4, including three basic models, a hatchback, a sedan, and an SUV, uh, each one with four levels of detail and unique properties now with VR support. So if you needed to add drivable cars to your game, uh, not only does this have the blueprints that control it, uh, but you've got the, th the three different models with multiple different LODs. So obviously, if you have some artistic ability, you should be able to adapt what you get here to work with your cars of choice. So um, break down what we get here. Three detailed cars, a hatchback, a sedan, SUV, four LODs, easy to configure materials, front, rear, and brake lights, inside, outside camera with zoom and orbit functions, animated doors, turnable steering wheel with driver's hands attached to it, third person compatible, and interactive car dashboard. That's a sweet package, I got to say. Uh, next up, we have the materialized VFX. Uh, warping models with a variety of preset effects such as voxelizer or cool burns in transition. Um, as pretty straightforward, actually. I think this one is implemented as blueprints. The effect solves the issue with a hollowed-looking model. They do not cut away or mask out the blue, uh, the model, but instead use a technique in a projecting a filled-in look to the existing geometry. So you can sort of see it in action right there. So here it's kind of filling it. Yeah, here we go. That last one was probably a good example of a way of just kind of filling it in. So if you've got, uh, again, the ability to materialize. So if you're trying to create a teleporter like from Star Trek, uh, that's kind of the effect that this one goes for. Uh, I don't specifically see if this is blueprints or not yet. Uh, I assume it actually is blueprints, but it, this one doesn't actually give you any details on what it is about. But if you need to do a special effect of materializing a, a solid model, that's what this one is all about. Next up, we have the modern city downtown with interiors, mega pack, urban buildings uh, slash urban building slash buildings, uh, modern city downtown with interior mega pack. This pack made by uh, or team uh, with big attention to details, quality of assets, and unique concepts, as well as an optimization. The pack includes 355 unique models. Pretty straightforward. It's basically a city. Uh, interior, exterior. Let's see if we get some interior shots going on here. So here's all the exteriors. Exterior. Okay, here we got a couple of interiors. So if you're trying to create a city landscape, maybe something for your car to drive around in, that's what this pack is all about. Regularly $211. This is probably one of the single best assets I have seen yet. I'm going to jump into it, take a closer look at see what the quality is like. But if you're trying to build a cityscape, this one is amazing. So I got to say, again, this month's content, really, really good. Uh, next up, we've got a sci-fi robot, a high-quality robot character with customizable materials. Uh, yeah, it's a robot. And you can modify it. It's pretty straightforward. I don't know that there's going to be a lot of use for this unless, of course, you want to make a driving game with a robot as the driver. Uh, but it is an ultra detailed robot character, almost 80,000 tries at LOD zero, multiple LODs here for LOD one, two, and three, in addition to zero, between 40,000 and 1,000 triangles. A bunch of materials. It's uh, animated. Oh, sorry. No custom animations included, but it is rigged. Um, so if you need a high, really high detail robot that's rigged, uh, I guess that one's good for you. Again, this one's a little bit less useful. Then again, the last pack was $211, and this one was $1688. And then finally, we've got the targeting system. The targeting system is a complete solution for customized directional targeting in UE4. Um, so multiplayer ready, use active rotation, control rotation, error tolerance for sorting targets to the left and right, use delta rotation or arc tan difference algorithms, auto switch targets on perception failure, auto switch targets if tar actor to target is invalid, show widget for lock on, uh, filter perceived actors to specific cases, and so on. This one is made as a component of four blueprints. So basically it is doing the targeting logic that you would expect for your game. And as I mentioned earlier on, there is no announced um, 
free forever content. So everything here, you've got to get it during the month of May. You've got until the first Tuesday of June to pick all this content up. Again, to buy it, really straightforward. Basically, just add it to your cart. So each one of these things, log in, uh, add it to your cart, add all of them to your cart, check out, and you are done. At the same time, if you have the Epic Games Launcher, which just failed an install, uh, you see here we've got... Um, you can come up here to free and they go to free for the month and you can get them this way as well. So just bang, basically bang, 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 and bang. What's really interesting though, is the robot is missing. I don't know why the robot is missing, but the robot is missing. So if you want to grab the, the robot, I'm guessing you're going to have to, um, either get it from the website or wait for them to fix it. For some reason, it's not showing up in the free category. Then again, this this application in general is, is kind of crap. So that's not really shocking. But again, if you want to grab the robot, you can log in online, grab it this way as well. And that is it. So that is this month's free content for Unreal Engine. Again, you'll have until the first Tuesday of June to quote and quote buy all this content. Uh, really straightforward collection, but really great stuff. So you got four drivable cars with full blueprint support, uh, materialized special effect for making things, you know, teleport. Uh, or materialize. Uh, we've got a really valuable asset here in this uh, city pack interior and exterior um, models for use in a uh, urban environment. Uh, a real high detail robot, which unfortunately seems to only be available on the website right now. And the targeting system, blueprint system. So if you need to have you know the ability to target between uh, multiple characters and so on, have it snap and do that kind of logic for you. That is basically what it's doing and is solving that via blueprints. So all told, a very nice pack. And of course, stay tuned. There is more Unreal Engine news coming. If I can figure out why that install in the background failed, I will be back later this afternoon with some more Unreal Engine content. Hopefully you heard me fine. Again, I am outside recording this. Beautiful day. I like being outside, but uh, hopefully the noise of the highway and my daughter did not make it into this one. Uh, hopefully Everything worked out fine. You like what you see for Unreal Christmas? Let me know what you think. Again, is this content, is it leaning you towards Unreal Engine yet? Or did you convert a long time ago and you're just hoarding it like I am? Let me know. Comments down below, and I will talk to you all later. Goodbye.